Westside Place really embodies everything that Far East Consortium is about. Delivering master planned precincts in vibrant locations. Delivering this project, even in the most extraordinary circumstances over the last 12 months, has been incredibly rewarding. Seeing this precinct and community come to life is phenomenal. What's been the most rewarding part of the eight-year journey with Westside Place for me has been watching what was a dormant site for almost 20 years spring into life and start to take shape. The precinct, Westside Place and 250 Spencer Street has been the number one searched property address on realestate.com.au for the last three quarters. We are so proud that not only we love this project, but the market on all fronts tends to agree. We sold 107 apartments in the last 12 months, even in the toughest market in the history of Melbourne. Whenever you step on the, this beautiful cobblestones from the, the arcade and the central runway, you know you are walking into somewhere very special and this tangible feeling, the quality feelings will take all the way from the lobby, from the lift, from the hallway to every single apartment. Over the last six months, out of the 80 apartments that we've leased out in Melbourne CBD, 63 of those have been at Westside Place. This is just a, a great testament to the building itself and the development and also the surrounds. We found that there was a big wave of new tenants coming into the city and a lot of these tenants actually came from suburban Melbourne. The great thing about these new tenants is just the calibre. They're local, they've got good jobs. In investor terms, the tenants are great. One of the most exciting elements of this precinct is the Ritz-Carlton Melbourne. I'm thrilled to announce that we will be opening the hotel on the 2nd of February next year. It'll be a key component of bringing this precinct to life and we are thrilled to already be recruiting for new staff and we have welcomed the hotel manager who is already working on site. We spent a lot of time trying to convince the Ritz that they should have a hotel in Melbourne and the draw card was the artwork and was the underground culture that Melbourne was proud of, the small coffee shops, the unique bars, the owner operators and it's something that we have built into the Ritz an art collection that is very Melbourne based. With the development of this nature you'd obviously expect some premium food and beverage offerings and that's exactly what we got. A premium Australian restaurant on level 80. Not only is the cuisine going to be great but also the uh, panoramic views of the CBD skyline which will be exceptional. We've also got a premium Chinese yum cha tenancy. This will be something that's unique and new for the Australian market so we're really excited to have that retailer open and succeed. Westside Place is seen as the golden triangle. I think foot traffic is absolutely brilliant. Uh, we're sitting right next to Southern Cross Station, one of the most busiest train stations we have in Melbourne CBD. Foot traffic, uh, international students, the uh, quality definitely inspired us to want to be part of the journey. So I think uh, definitely working in line with Forest and Sortium and you know, right under luxury hotel Ritz Carlton, I think that's that ticked a lot of boxes. The Melbourne CBD retail market's definitely struggled of late. That's fair enough considering the COVID lockdowns and restrictions that we've recently experienced. Having said that, the growth that's been experienced in the west end of the CBD towards Southern Cross Station has been exceptional. It's been an absolute pleasure to lease this development and I'm really looking forward to seeing it come alive so we can deliver um, something exceptional for our residents. Over the last six months, we've seen the community evolve. We've seen people settle, move in, and help determine an address and a destination. We've seen amenities spring to life. We've seen a lifestyle that's new and evolving and uh, quite exciting. It's almost like living in a resort. Researching how tenants are enjoying living here, how our owner occupiers are enjoying living here and how our investors, where they've landed with their tenants. I can honestly say that I truly believe have pulled off a very successful project, building an amazing community, despite all of the challenges we've had. So the exciting thing is, is what's next and what's to come.